طيب الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله. Uh, first of all, the hijra by the meaning of hijra, mm-hmm. today it is uh, almost impossible, especially for the rivers, because the hijra means to leave the land of kufr to uh, the land of Islam, and to leave that land of kufr means to cut all relations with the kuffar, as the Prophet ﷺ said. أنا بريء من مؤمن مسلم يعيش بين الرعايا الكفار. I am free from Muslim who lives amongst the kuffar. And also uh, has to cut all the contacts and, and relations with those lands, which is today is almost impossible except for people who are not uh, يعني from that land. For example, they are from originally from Muslim countries, like if they are from um, some Muslim Asian countries or Muslim uh, African countries, and they left to uh, any Kuffar country and lived there for a while and got their nationality. So they easily can go back to their land and get their own nationality and get rid of that Western nationality. By that, then they can do the Hijra. But If it is a river from America, for example, or from uh, Canada or any Western country that uh, want to make the, the hijra to a Muslim land, which land that he says, I go there and stay and get their nationality? That is almost impossible. I didn't say impossible, but it is almost impossible. It is 95% impossible. Therefore, we say the advice is not to go for Hijra uh, because the, once they go for Hijra, they are not allowed to return back to the uh, non-Muslim land. They are not allowed to go back to the non-Muslim land. So the best thing is to um, intend, intend to go and live for uh, whatsoever period Allah permits in a Muslim land amongst Muslims And that will only uh, be conducted by uh, business visa or working visa or like that. So if she has no uh, mahram, then she is not allowed to do it because it is not hijra. But if it is a term of hijra, then yes, she is allowed to travel even without a mahram. Even without a mahram because... The women at the time of Rasulullah left Mecca and left some other places and came to Medina without mahram, and that's why, and without their husbands, without mahram, because this is hijra. This is hijra. So uh, hijra means that they're not going to go back to to uh, to uh, Mecca. Same thing now. If she's only going to have uh, to stay in a Muslim land with her uh, kafir uh, country passport, that is not a hijra. She did not cut the relation between her and the kuffar. So and instead of doing that, she better go for yani, a business or yani, like that, work. And then... Uh, In that case, she cannot travel without a mahram because this is not hijrah. Wallahu a'ala.